If you're an agency owner or a coach and you've been thinking about starting a YouTube channel for some time already, or maybe this idea literally just popped into your head and that's why you clicked on this video. But regardless of the reason, in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly why you need a YouTube channel in 2025 and beyond. So getting straight into it, in this video, I'm gonna show you why having a YouTube channel and building your brand is no longer optional. I'm gonna show you how to position yourself as the number one in your niche. And I'm gonna show you my authority building framework that will literally make you look better than all your competitors. Now, the first and main reason why I think that having a YouTube channel and building your brand online as an agency owner or a coach is no longer optional is because when your clients come to you they don't really know a lot about the problem they are facing or they know they have a problem they know don't know specifically how to solve it and then who's going to actually be the best at helping them solve that and that's basically why they are looking for a solution in the first place and that's why they want you to help them with it the problem here is that because they don't know how to fix it they also can't tell if you're the best option or not you know so let's say you're running an e-commerce agency you're serving e-commerce brands and you're helping them with whatever it is you know email marketing facebook ads the thing is if they come to you and they want your help with it that probably means that the owner you know who came to you is not an expert in that field like he doesn't really know how a good email marketing you know looks like how good facebook ads look like well they know that if it's making money it's good if it's not making money it's bad but they don't know the specifics they also don't know because of it, like how to choose the best ones and here what comes to my mind is you know there's a lot of these memes where you buy a hundred and fifty thousand dollar bmw and then you meet a girl and she says oh my dad has the same and basically on the screen, as you can see, I have an example of like BMW M3, which costs like 150,000. And then we have like all five series, which is priced at around like 15K, which is literally like 10 times less. The thing is, because she doesn't know that much about cars, she doesn't really see the difference. You know, this is BMW, this is BMW. Well, the color is different, but you know, if she would have to choose, well, maybe she would be able to pick the M3 as the better one. Cause like, well, it, it looks better on the outside, but that's mostly like what they, she would be looking at, you know, how it looks like on the outside. Or if it would come down to someone that is looking for a car and wants to buy one they would choose one based on price they will say okay yeah it looks pretty similar to me i don't see that many differences you know and that's why i'm gonna go with the cheaper one i'm gonna choose the 15k car because i don't see it being like 10 times better so why would i spend 135,000 more for a car that you know, I don't see that big of a difference. And that's basically what happens if you don't focus on building your brand online. You look like everyone else in that space. Cause like when someone is looking for a solution to their problem, when someone is looking for an agency or a coach to hire, they're gonna do it based on the information they can see. And usually the information they can see is like the, the outside, you know, the outside of, you know, a car, for example, here. So even in the inside, you are 10 times better agency. You know, you have better systems, you have better team, like all of that. It doesn't really matter that much because at the end of the day, what they can see and I, like, whether they perceive you as an authority or not, which we, will be the deciding factors. And when you're not seen as an authority or a top expert, you'll always be compared to other people in the space. And then many times the decision would come down to price or like who they like more. So the worst part here is that there might be like 10 times worse agencies making content online. Because of that, they will be the one seen as an expert, you know, authority, like as the best agency in that specific space, that specific niche, not you. I'm sure you saw that. Competitors with like worse offers, worse results, worse worst customer experience, worst team, worst systems make way more money than you. Because what they are good at is the way they present themselves, how they look and you know, how they are perceived. And because of it, they maybe are building their brand. They are, have a YouTube channel. They have a solid LinkedIn presence. They create a lot of content. And that's why they are seen as the authority. And that's why they make way more money than you. And I'm gonna show you one example that you're probably familiar with, you know, Iman Ghazi, who has a program, you know, initially he had a program helping people start and scale their agencies. And like to this date, he has a similar program, just different versions of that. And if you talk to anyone in this space who've been through his program and maybe other agency programs, usually they will say the other programs were better, like they were more technical, more going more in depth on specific topics. They help them more, but no one even comes close when it comes to like how much they are making from selling these programs compared to Iman. Iman probably makes more money than like all the info products in that space, you know, combined, despite having worse products and probably because of it also like worse results. And another example here, you know, there's a guy I know in the space who sells a 10K program. And I hear from multiple people in the space, it's one of the worst programs they've been in. Literally, you know, some of them said it is pretty much like a scam. Yet this guy consistently hits 100K months selling it because he looks like a trustworthy person. He creates the content online and he basically took it to this 
extent where the pro he doesn't even care about the product the offer he's just creating content online and basically that attracts some clients because people see him as a top authority you know top expert in the specific space and that's how he signs a client on a client on a client and that's why if you have a good product if you are actually a solid you know agency if you have a good coaching program whatever it is that you're selling it's really unethical for you to not use these things to your advantage and that's why you need to start building your brands online and i'm going to give you one example here for one of our clients nick he's been doing you know youtube for some time already he has a solid youtube channel with like 40 000 subscribers and more and the thing is you know aside from the fact that clients directly come to him through the content and that's going to be the same like if you start a youtube channel clients will directly come to you through the content you're creating but if you're doing any type of outbound whether that's on linkedin whether that's cold emails whether you're doing ads it will perform so much better because if you get an email from nick who has a big YouTube channel and you do some research and you see, oh, this guy is absolutely killing it. This guy is an authority in that space. There's like 10 times more chan higher chance that they're gonna reply to this email and actually decide to book a call with him. Same thing if they see his ads and then they also see his content, they can do some research. That's also why your close rate will shoot up because even if you're doing outbound ads and you're getting, you know, booked calls from that, but you let people consume your content before they call and like educate themselves, see some good case study videos that you have, there's a way higher chance that at the end, they're gonna basically convert. So like it's gonna increase your closing rate and sometimes it might even double it prospects would choose you instead of competitors because now you'll be the one seen as an expert in your field compared to you know now maybe your competitors and that's why you know when they will be making the decision instead of going with them they will go with you because they watch your content they're familiar with you they trust you maybe they like the content they see the results that you're getting your clients and that's why they will choose you but aside from all of those marketing and sales benefits having a youtube channel will also help you attract a players and it's an ultimate networking tool and i can speak from experience because at my agency 80 percent of the hires really come through my business partner personal brand so he's creating youtube content and he has a pretty big audience here in poland and whenever we need to hire an, a, a player for the team we have a full inbox of applicants for pretty much every position that we can pick from so now we're also saving a lot of money on just the recruiting costs you know like a lot of time on trying to find the right candidate because we have full inboxes of people wanting to work with us so that's the additional benefit that will help you you know maybe not get more clients but definitely scale your agency Weaker. Now, if you've been thinking about starting on growing your YouTube channel to get more clients, whether for the agency, whether it's for a coaching offer, but you want to see the results like our clients, you want to see all the benefits here, but you don't want to do it yourself, you just want the right process and the team that can help you do it so you don't have to spend more than three hours a week, go ahead and book a one-on-one -on -one call with me so I can walk you through our process in more details and show you basically what strategy we could implement together to help you scale. Now, if you're not ready yet to do that, make sure to go watch this video next where I talk with one of our clients about his experience and the type of results he got from YouTube. And once you watch it, make sure to come back here and book that call. So looking forward to chatting with you soon and make sure to watch this video next.